Hey everyone, I'm Sarah from Sweater Home Lisbon and today I'm here being Fika to show you this brand new co-living space. We are in front of the zoo of Lisbon, which is really cool because some uh, rooms have an amazing view of the zoo. You can see all of the green, you can hear the birds, it's amazing. And it's well located in terms of um, transportation, so you're well served, you're well connected to the rest of the city. Um, and the co-living space, as I told you, is brand new, so some parts are still under development. But right now we have a really nice living room, a co-working space, and then a shared kitchen downstairs. And then each floor has its own kitchen as well. So it's four shared kitchens in total. And plus, we're going to have some rooms with kitchens inside of the spaces. So you're well served with kitchens, alright? Um, so yeah, let's check this out. So here we are, this is the ground floor. First, let me show you the co-working space. There you go. As you can see, there's a lot of sunlight coming in. We're gonna have this huge uh, desk here, glass um, table for eight people. And then we have an extra chair here. And we're gonna have some cool um, fun facts about the animals in the zoo, which is right in front of us. Okay. And right here, we're gonna have this counter. Just making sure that we have power outlets everywhere, okay? Here and there as well. Awesome. So this is the co-working space. Now let's open this door here. Over there, we're gonna have a laundry room as well, under payment, but right now it's in the construction, it's not ready, but the machine's already there. And this is the living room. Very, very spacious. We're gonna have this huge L-shaped couch, two chairs, and then a TV with cable, okay? The AC, of course, bookshelf, another couch, two chairs, all right? And here we have a coffee counter with a coffee machine, some cookies, a mirror, two seats. And here we have a dining table really spacious one, mirror, and then we have a shared kitchen here with a stove top and oven, and down here we have the dishwasher, okay, cupboards, and here we have the fridge, and the freezer, actually, no, just a cupboard, okay, up here we have more cupboards all right super super nice so that's a common area here we're gonna have a bathroom as well but it's under construction and if we go upstairs here we're gonna find the garden but it's also in the development they're gonna put some flowers and plants some trees so it's gonna be even more beautiful but right now you can enjoy the sun here and on this picnic table all right Awesome. So that was the common areas. Now let's check out the bedrooms. And this is the corridor. First, let's start with bedroom number one, which is right here. All right, we're gonna have a single bed. On this side, we're gonna have a desk with a chair and then a lamp and this little bookshelf. Over there, we have a mirror and then a mini fridge. Do I open this? There you go. A mini fridge, and we're gonna have some drawers here, some shelves up there, the AC, of course, as always. Okay, and here we have this little shoe rack, the bathroom with a toilet seat, a sink, and then the shower. There you go. And then here we have a mirror and then the boiler. Okay. And a really cool thing about those rooms is the ceiling. Look, so cool. And over here, we're gonna have a balcony with a set of chair and um, table. And then this is the view. That over there is the common garden. Okay, so cool. All right, going back here. So we covered bedroom number one. Now, this is bedroom number two. There you go. This one is a little bit different. I'm gonna have two single beds instead. And big bookshelves here and there. But the ceiling's still really cool. Okay. 
the AC over there as always. Every bedroom has AC. And a little breakfast table here for two. A little kitchen with a microwave sink and then a mini fridge. And some storage space here. And up here as well. All right. We're gonna have a shelf here as well where you can put seasonings or food, whatever you want. And here's the bathroom. So we're gonna have the toilet seat here and the shower. Okay. And then here we have the sink and then the mirror and then a little window that goes to the balcony. I'm gonna show you in a minute. Here we are. This is the same view as we just seen before. There we go. All right, awesome. Now let's go back here for the rest of the bedrooms. So that was the number two. All bedrooms have uh, pens to get in, so it's pretty safe. And here we have a common kitchen for this floor. We're gonna have this really, really cute um, set of pink seats with a table, marble table. And then here we have the stove top, the oven, the sink. Down here, we're gonna have some storage space. And up here, we're gonna have some cupboards, the boiler, coffee machine, water boiler, a toaster, more storage space here. All right. And for the rooms that don't have the kitchen, we're gonna have some private cupboards here with the passwords, microwave, some shelves. Okay, really, really cool. And now we are in bedroom number three. Okay, on this side here, we're gonna have the kitchen with the sink, a microwave, cupboards, the fridge, same deal as uh, we just seen. And then here's the bathroom with a toilet seat, the shower, and then you have a mirror, e, the sink. And here we have a double bed, a shelf right on top, and then this really nice bookshelf, a table, a shoe rack, a mirror, and then the cool ceiling again. And here we have a different view. This is facing the zoo. Okay. Oh, so, so nice. You can hear the birds from here. All right. Super cool. So that was version number three. Now finally, bedroom number four. Okay, as soon as you get in, you see the bathroom here. We're gonna have the shower all together with the toilet. And here we have the sink area with a mirror, okay? And here you have the bed area with a double bed, and then you're gonna have this clothing rack here slash booking shelf. And here we have a desk, the mini fridge over there, okay? And you have a big window over there facing the zoo. All right. Very cool. I hope you liked it and I'll see you next time. Bye-bye.